We'll introduce, uh, uh, my name's Brian, I'm actually uh, the lead singer of the band Pitchback Hero, but collectively we are Elvis Monroe, and uh, we have Ben Carey. <laughs> can't speak. I was, I, was, I was being a silent guy, it doesn't work for radio. Really. No, <laughs> they can't see! Uh, my name's Ben, I play guitar for Elvis, and uh, I'm also in the band for the White House. I think we've heard of you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm Ryan. All right. And I'm, uh, I'm tired. I'm uh, filling in for the light from Matt Nelson, who's uh, not here, but I'm, I'm helping out the boys. All right. <laughs> we had to get a look away. We had to get a look away. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good looking blonde bass player, and, and Todd, not quite so good looking, but he's blonde bass player. And I think Matt's actually listening, so that's yeah. why. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, too bad. He can't talk back to us right now. <laughs> All right, yeah. so let's talk about what you're doing in town here. Uh, we're, we're actually in town doing the You Choose project with um, the boys from Stadium, which are standing in the, in the room as well. Dave and his brother Ben. Yeah, yeah. D I'm Dave Velasquez, and I'm with the band Stadium. And we're local guys uh, that have uh, the awesome opportunity to play with these shows with, with the band. So, we're, we're as uh, in awe as you guys are, just hanging out with these guys this week and being on this tour. It's really cool. And, and we keep that, you know, because we're going to people killed for this opportunity. It's really cool to be, to be doing this. So, and, uh, and then Ben is here. I play drums for Stadium. And yeah, it's just cool. We're doing this uh, YouTube project. And we're running around doing some of this abuse prevention with uh, a couple local schools. And then we come up with that too. And we're doing a couple shows. Uh, we're doing some external shows that everyone can come to at um, Club Millennium, 7, I believe. 7.30. 7 o'clock. 7 seven o'clock on Friday night, Club Millennium. Yeah, and then we're doing the what's the list? Um, 18th Sports Complex. Um, Saturday night. Yeah, and that, that one you can get, uh, Brian, you can get free tickets. Yeah, you can get free tickets to go to youchooseproject.org. Where you go to the stadium Facebook site or the Elvis Monroe Facebook site, you can find out the information to get free tickets in advance for the show, for the for the show out in Los Um If you don't get the free, we have two thousand to give away. If you don't get them, then you have to pay at the door. But this is our way of you know, giving back and seeing what kind of impact that we have when we're playing the schools. Like today, we're playing the South. Oh no, South today. Today's South, yeah. Yeah, at one o'clock. Um, and then tomorrow it's what service? Is that tomorrow right? service, and then on uh, on Thursday we have uh, Wasilla, or excuse me, Colony High, and then on Friday we we have uh, Wasilla. And I want to say on the Saturday show, um, we we've got a lot of local groups out there that have helped out and pitched in. That's who's, who's picking up the tickets out there. So I want to say um, what's up to Gretchen uh, and everybody over there at the Matsu Substance Abuse Prevention Coalition and Community Sports and Matsu uh, Health Foundation. In, uh, in, in, in that course, and everybody up there. So um, they're they're kicking in some money and buying tickets so you guys can all come out and see this. We're supposed to be preventing what Ben said, and that's, that's what we're about. So, but these guys are the ones you should be talking to. <laughs> <laughs> it's very inspirational, and I want to hear about what the You Choose uh, well, the project is about. Choose pro the you Choose project is is us standing up in, in we're doing this rock show in the gyms, mm -hmm. and we're leading by example, but we're also you're getting to see some of these people who have went through the worst of the worst and they're standing there in front of these kids saying, hey, I've done this and this is what's happened to me. And, and then there's 10 of them standing there giving this sad story and then what happened with uh, Dave and his and Ben, their uncle, um, you, you see this video. And then we lead by example. Um, I've never done drugs. I don't even know what alcohol tastes like. Mm -hmm. And um, it just, we just stand there and go, he had looked at my life, and it was a choice I made at your age. And it's great. And, and here I am. But we're not saying, do as I do. We're not saying that. We're, in no way we're, yeah, we're just leading by example. Mm -hmm. And leading by example in the other way. That's why those people are standing there saying, hey, I've done this, and, and I lived on the streets, and I'm coming back, you know, right now. But, and that's their focus, is coming back. Why choose to, to make that decision? Mm -hmm. You know, make make the good ones. I think uh, it's really important for us to, um, when Brian came to us, uh, Dave and Brian put a lot of work in getting this idea off the ground. I know for me, I grew up in a really, really tiny, tiny country town in Australia where, you know, similar to a place like Alaska, you know, you can fall into making some really stupid decisions, you know, early on in life. Um, when you're
they're definitely, definitely not here to teach the kids no, and tell them don't do this because, you know, high school kids, young kids are the most impressionable people on the planet. When you tell them not to do something, they're going to do it. Mm -hmm. You know, we're not here to tell them to do anything. We're not here to tell them not to do anything. We're just here to be ourselves and show them that if, if you dare to do it, if you, if you have the guts to follow that dream and have the courage to go after it, if you have the courage to stand on your own two feet and not be insecure about who you really are, and make good choices, then great things can happen. You know, I have great people around me every day because of the choices I made. Uh, people in my life from when I was a kid helped me make those decisions, you know, not by telling me what to do, mm -hmm. by letting me believe I can make my own decisions and I can be my own person, you know, and this is such a great cause, you know, to see these kids, to, I mean, Ryan, you know, like you were saying yesterday about, imagine if a man came to, uh, yeah. to your school. Yeah, you know? I mean, uh, as a kid, you know, I mean, I, I just wanted to play music, that's all I cared about, and that was, that was my job, so, um, to have somebody, like, for, for this to happen now, if I, you know, had some a band that I admire, or people from band that I admire from my school, and tell me, you know, the choices they made to get where they are, I mean, that would, that would be a huge influence. Huge, huge. Yeah. yeah. As you guys talk, I get chills thinking about it. It's who you surround yourself with yeah. every single day. And I heard this morning a story about you guys kind of having an aha moment, maybe um, with people coming up to you as yeah. you're doing this. I'd like to share that story. Uh, you know, we all did. And mine was, um, you know, we talked about it. We're, we're, we're doing a documentary film about this as well. Uh, so because we're going to take this to 50 states if we can, you know, and um, starting in the spring. But... My moment was the impact of a, a young girl yesterday who leaned in. I mean, she looked like rocker, pink hair, you know, just full on, like maybe too cool for school kind mm -hmm. of thing. She leans in and said, you're my new role model. And I went, what? And she goes, I had to repeat herself and then I had to save the camera because we had lunch in between the shows and we talked about it where we're not gonna see the impact that mm -hmm. we had. Mm -hmm. And then yesterday we did. We all had individual mm -hmm. moments with students that we... How fulfilling, and you guys yeah. just started. We just yeah. started. Right. Yesterday was day yeah. one. That, 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 was, that was pop from day one. And uh, we, were, we were discussing it those two experiences that we had in the class. And when we, when we got on the plane and we had a class, I said, if we, if we, can, if we can affect one of the kids' lives, just one. Mm -hmm. It's worth it. You know, it's, yeah. worth, it's worth the effort. The stuff you guys don't see, Dave and Ben from the stadium, you should have seen those guys like pack mules trying to be <laughs> yesterday. You know, loading stages, putting screens up, running cables from the crack of dawn until late, late evening. You know, the amount of work that goes into this. Because these guys really care about, you know, we've all been kids. We've all made, you know, we've probably made decisions that we shouldn't. We've probably made decisions that got us to where we are now. And, you know, as I said, we can make a difference with one kid. We did half a show yesterday and we had numerous experiences, I know all of us had one in particular, that, you know, that's four kids in, in the first hour. You know, Absolutely it's, it's pretty, it's pretty amazing. It was really yes. cool. Yes. Really, yes. really, really cool. And we're done by, you know, Yeah, and the day has <laughs> barely started. Yeah. There's, there's no one drunk at the end of the night. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. There's still time for me to see you there. You got it. <laughs> All right. Well, I'd like you guys to play one number. Yeah, sure. Yeah, that this, would be great. This song is uh, it's called Coming Around. We're actually working on, we're halfway through our EP, and um, you, uh, we hope you enjoy this one. Um, I think I did. Whoops. I didn't know that. Yeah, these guys are just tearing up your studio. Yeah. <laughs> we'll let you. Don't worry. Uh, <laughs> I already took the picture. What's that? I'm sorry. Well, I mm -hmm. took the picture. Oh, nice. I nice. miss Alice Welling in here as my photographer. Hey. Yeah. I hired the best of the best. <laughs> so, just for the, for the listeners, um, the Silver Fox. Yeah, Ryan. 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 <laughs> I, I got this new game when I showed up here. Yeah. yeah. Somehow. <laughs> He's actually going to play the last game. He's going to play the, the Alaskan <laughs> time. Right. right. Uh, so. Anchorage Daily News. Anchorage Daily News. Yeah. Yeah. Sports yeah. section. Yeah. Sports section. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, songs start coming around. Alright, here we go. I've seen so many things in my chosen. Diamonds in the sky. 
love it i love it we're, we're just Which so excited is. because we just got the mix last night and mm -hmm. hey shout out to jay rustin oh jay rustin we yeah, love you man our producer i'm gonna fuck you <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you can also find us at, at uh, the twitter account elvis monroe one i'm elvis on it i'll follow you yeah, as elvis. you walk and out <laughs> elvis monroe facebook as well please um this is great. I, and a shout out to Anger Management, Chris Cardenas. He's kind of making this, this machine run. He's the oil that's, that's making all this happen. And Mammoth so, Music. Mammoth Music. Mammoth Music yeah, is yeah. awesome, awesome, awesome. The National Guard as well. Thank you so much. Um, everybody who's involved in this, if we left somebody out, and all the kids that are helping out, all, all the crew. The faculty. Yeah. Exactly. Everybody's really welcoming. And uh, we just want to thank you. Thank you for having us. Oh, are you kidding me? Any time. And thank yeah. you so much for coming in this morning. What you're doing is, like, I can't say inspirational enough, I don't think, because <laughs> you guys are just going to go out to these high schools and make such a huge impact on people. Elvis any, Monroe. If there's any parents, too, that are listening and want to bring their kids, bring them. How fun. Go, go, yes. to the, go to the front office. Get a pass. At South High School. What time are you guys going to be there? Talk your way in. Talk your way in. It's, it's, yeah. I mean, the message is huge. It's powerful, and it's um, it's kind of it's shocking in that like, the way it comes out. It's kind of cool. Right. Okay. Well, here we go. Black clouds, and we are the second person on the planet.